would like to start by saying that I'm really very thankful to the U.S. State Department for their financial support and specifically to uh, the program of Dr. Jeff Margolis. He's supported us financially but also um, helped us with our ideas. This workshop is a fantastic opportunity for the Tunisian and Moroccan universities and professionals to get together and really understand what innovation and creativity are and how they can apply those efforts in entrepreneurship. And uh, so far, the students have been so receptive to uh, the ideas presented. The speakers have been top-notch and um, I uh, only see positives. Uh, and I really hope that we'll have opportunities to put together similar uh, uh, events in the future so that there is continuity uh, and there is um, a focus on uh, this very important topic specifically for North Africa. that have happened today are very positive. Uh, academia and the professionals and the students are being able to discuss uh, ways that they can move forward in the process to build uh, a better, to uh, build the future of Morocco and Tunisia. Uh, there's also been talks of individuals working together and discussing opportunities for the future, uh, both here within Morocco in developing workshops here on uh, innovation and entrepreneurship, as well as developing collaborative efforts between Morocco and Tunisia. The workshop was really beneficial. We learned a lot of new things about, uh, from uh, the teacher that, 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 that they come from um, USA and from uh, Tunisia and Moroccan teachers. I just want to thank uh, all, all of them from, for their, their, their times, their, uh, their experiences. Guess that uh, that actually, I mean, uh, the the private sector should be re really viable. I mean, we should give life to the private sector because we know that uh, the. the they, I mean, the country cannot give give jobs to everyone. That's why the idea of this workshop. that uh, this workshop is very beneficial for us as engineering students because nowadays more than ever an engineer should not be just a technician he, ju uh, he uh, should uh, know how to uh, be a leader it's an amazing opportunity for, uh, for us as, an engin as uh, engineers to build uh, skills about, uh, about uh, management and entrepreneurship and uh, I hope that will help us uh, to uh, to uh, go uh, to achieve our dreams about uh, leading, uh, about leading and uh, and, to, and uh, making uh, enterprises and uh, create wealth and uh, uh, change the world with our dreams. to attend this uh, workshop and this it will be a, a great opportunity for us to learn uh, uh, a lot of qualities like uh, creativity innovation also it was uh, an opportunity to make this uh, transition between what we learned theory and uh, 
the professional domains. Today, uh, I feel a, re a professional one, a professional man, or I feel really I'm an, a real engineer. <clears throat> because in general, in school, uh, at school or uh, uh, at the establishment, we do uh, in general t uh, technical things, technical words, uh, re resolve equations, etc. But here, I think actually we have revealed uh, several prob uh, problems that uh, exist in reality. Uh,